hello hello everyone welcome back to the channel miss crochet and coffee here and today we have unbagging this unbagging today comes to us from the, the store fan sales now i was asked i believe it was by sariba henry to check out this store she wanted to get what i thought as you know how their product was and everything and i was like uh yeah so i went ahead and ordered but as you guys know with the coronavirus uh spreading rapidly over in china our thoughts and prayers are out to them one two packages have been delayed significantly from china because of the virus now don't worry uh patriotic beauty said it best if you have lysol wipes uh it can't last long outside of the, its host which it needs a host like a body to to spread the germs it doesn't last long outside of the host so you don't need to worry about your your packages being contaminated or what have you either way so let's get into this. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. So like this, this company puts me in the mind of like a CES deals or a Peggy buy or any buy or all the buys. We're going to get rid of that. So we have three canvases now. And yes, I did order three canvases. I don't know what either of them is. Uh, editing, Leisha will make sure to add pictures as I unbox them. So we're going to get rid of these two for right now. We're just going to throw them over there. So let's open up this first one. Hopefully I won't need my scissors. Can I use my little Hello Kitty scissors that I got from Shine Like a Diamond? No. Next time, Hello Kitty. So we're just going to have to rip into this like a savage. Like a boss. All right, there we go. So it is nicely protected. It came in two different sleeves. Here is the first one. Uh, we're going to get rid of that. It looks like pour glue. So we're going to open it up. Boom, 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 boom. You guys, look at how cute that is. It's two hedgehogs on a pen. Now, I don't remember ordering this, but that doesn't say anything since Miss Coffee has a horrible memory. All right, so let's take a look. It is pork glue. It's a 30 by 40, which we are going to measure. Um, it does have the, the key on both sides. I do like that. Let's get into the business here. Holy confetti. So we have little E's and U's and question marks. And I think that's an L. Um, or no, it's a kind of like a parentheses, almost like one of those brackets, I guess it's called. You have the less than and greater than symbol. Well, that's a greater than symbol. So as you can see, it's clear as day. The clarity of the symbols is awesome. I'm just going to move around to a couple of spots here. So there we have that. It does have, again, it has a legend on both sides. It says it's a 30 by 40. Here are its drills. You get a basic tool kit with it, which is the green boat, the, the plate of wax, and the pink pen. We don't care about that. Now, when getting kits like this, you want to check... Because I, I did watch a video where a young lady said that she was ripped off by a company because they gave her kits that weren't the size that she ordered. She ordered like a 30 by 40 and it was not the drill area. It was the canvas size. Now, when you're shopping on sites like Peggy Buy, CES Deals, Annie Buy, stuff like that, these little off-brand China sites, you have to keep in mind, unless it says drill area is that size, more than likely it's going to be the canvas size. That's just how they do things. If it says canvas size is a 30 by 40, then that tells you that the canvas, the whole canvas itself is going to be 30 by 40. That's just how they word things. So you have to read carefully if you want it to be the exact size. Because a lot of those companies actually do the canvas size and not the drilling area. And they will usually include a picture. So pay attention when you're buying these things because that's just how a lot of companies word it. It's essentially not ripping you off, but kind of, sort of, kind of, maybe. Either way, we're not, we're not, we're not going to go there. So it says it's a 30 by 40. So we're going to pull out our little measuring tape here. And yes, my measuring tape is Hello Kitty. Thank you, Karen Doss. And let's see. So, and we're going glue to glue. So we got the zero right there. So we got 35. to 25. So it's the 35 by 25, not 30 by 40. So you're missing a couple inches. So the 30 by 40 on this is the entire canvas, not the drilling area. That is fine. 
It is going to still be incredibly cute. It has that normal oil canvas feeling to it. Again, it's like another site like any buy CES deal, stuff like that. Here are its drills. So let's see what colors we're working with here. It's in the baggies that I like because these baggies typically don't have a lot of trash. So that's a plus. It's also a plus that it has a legend on both sides. It's also a plus that it has clear drill or sim on um, field. So let's take a look at these drills. You will get stragglers, and that's fine with me. Nice, bright, vibrant colors. Even if I didn't order this painting, it's hella cute. So I'm still going to do it. When? I don't know, but I'm. It's, it's hella cute. There's a lot of greens in there. Some blues and browns. And this is just a snack size. So if you're looking for a good snack size painting, check out Fan Cells. You know, they have the good snack size painting. And we're going to go ahead and roll this back up here. And these companies don't tend to have, like, any special diamonds unless you get, like, a notebook or a bookmark. So you're not going to get A-B drills. But you can always modify it if you want A-B drills. Uh, that's what Diamond Sparklers with Tima is for. That's what all your leftover A-B drills are for. So there is that canvas. And we're going to put this away. We're going to do a little movie magic. And see what we have to come up next. You ready? There we have it. All right. Canvas number two. Let's check this one out. Let's see what we got here. It's glued shut very well. I give them that too. Like so far, so good. We're gonna get rid of that. We can get get, get the hell out of here. All right. All right. I think it goes this way. Oh yeah. All right. So it says our love is forever. It's just an infinity symbol with a heart. The background where it may look like one color is not. It is confetti. Um, again, basic toolkit, boat, wax, pen. You know All right. So we have our drills. Again, we have the legend on both sides. This one only has six colors. Whoa. Okay. And I can read out what it says there, and you can too from looking in the viewfinder. Close up, I couldn't see it at first, but if I look in the viewfinder, I can see it. It says, our love is forever. I thought this would be a cute little addition to the house because, you know, me and Mr. Coffee, you know, that whole cheesy love thing. So, I did remember ordering this one. And again, editing, Alicia's going to put up a nice picture for you so you can see what it is. Let's take a look at our six colors. And it's going to have a lot of doubles because, uh, let's see, on the bag itself, it gives you the canvas number. So it says JH042. Oh, get down to the business so you can see it. JH042 slash 4. JH042. And I'm going to guess that slash 4. Well, I don't know because this one says 455. Five. So I'm going to guess that's the number here on the the side. So, uh, number five would be 37, seven, 37, 70 for these two. Number six would be 38, 65. Number three would be 407. Two would be 310. And then number one would be 223. So I like the way they did that on the bags where it not only gives you, cause if I put this away without, like if I separate the drills from the canvas, I know which ones go where. So I know this goes to this canvas and this color is, uh, DMC code number 407. So they get brownie points. I'm really liking this company. They're, they're a little bit better than CES deals and stuff then because not uh, their drill quality and stuff seems to be consistent. Um, the baggie seem to be consistent where it doesn't look like it's just a reseller. It could very well be, but they're, the, the quality of it seems to be a little bit better than something I would say from CES deals. Um, they did, if I remember correctly, have a pretty good selection of stuff too. They may have some stolen images, so just keep that in mind. Um, but yeah, I really, really like this. Let's look at the symbol clarity because we didn't look at it. We were <laughs> all kinds of excited and didn't even look at the symbol clarity. So we have our Ds, which are clearest day. We have our Fs, our Es. Even with these two colors being close, I can see that the F is a slight different, a slightly different color then the E and it's just on the highlighting point. So here on the side here, over here, those little spot splotches are F's. Everything else, let's see, A's and B's. It's like a report card. 
So you got A, C, B, all the Ds. It doesn't look like any of these symbols are going to be hard to read. I don't even think I'm going to need a light pad for it. Bab. <laughs> so yeah, clarity of symbols is there. It does have a picture of what the image is supposed to look like. It only has six colors. The drills look great. So another great canvas. So let's pull out canvas number three. These canvases, I'm telling you, they just get better and better. So let's take a look here. And it did take quite a while for this to get to me. But again, remember that with that coronavirus, we're not going to hold it against them that if it takes a little bit longer, as long as it got here is all that I care about. Um, because if you didn't remember from back when I first started my channel, I ordered a canvas from New Frog and it never showed up. They gave me a fake tracking number and then made me wait a month before they would refund me. So, yeah. Um, so just the fact that it got here. Yeah. All right. So we got this. We're going to get that the hell out of here. Here we go. What's this last one? Oh, we didn't measure the other one. We'll measure it. It's a boat. That's right. It's a sailboat. Made me think of a pirate ship. All right, so this is also a 30 by 40, which I'm gonna guess for all of these, it's gonna be the canvas and not the actual uh, drill area, which real quick before I forget. Yep, 35 by 25. So it's gonna be the canvas, not the drill area. I'm gonna assume the same thing on the last one, which we'll see here in a few minutes. But look at that, you guys. Uh-oh. You guys see it? Boob. B-O-O-B. -O -O Boob. Boob. Cobb. Does anybody else find little words in their kits? All right, so these symbols are also very clear. You may or may not need a light pad because of the apersan ap symbol. I think it's called apersan symbol. The and symbol. You may or may not you may or may not need a light pad for some of these, but for the most part, the symbols look clear. Like they don't look like they're fading or anything. This canvas has 27 colors. Look at that sunshine on the side. Again, with the basic toolkit. I don't care about that toolkit. Oh. For those folks wondering what to do with those little basic toolkits, if you go over to your local library or elementary school and ask them, a lot of the times they can actually use those green boats. Um, I'm not sure if they use the wax or the pen, but they will use those green boats for stuff for the classroom. So if you're having an, a surplus of green boats and you don't know what to do with them, um, for the pink pens and wax, you can always find a YouTube creator that makes and sells like uh, pens. If they make and sell pens or do anything with wax, you can always ask them, can you donate that to them to continue making products? And then with the green boats, you can always take those over to the elementary school and see if they can use the green boats. And a lot of the times they can. So that's what you can do with those green boats and pens if you don't use them yourself. So let's see here. So we have number four, which is 30, 30, 322. I can't talk today. So 322 on the canvas is letter H. It has a canvas number on it, which is the Z1740. So let's try and decipher what the rest of these numbers are. So number four, because it has a negative 13 here and a negative four. So... I'm going to guess it's the four. Let's see. Let's find a color that we can identify and that, that'll tell us. So I do know 317 and 318 are gray colors. Plus it has the DMC code on it. So 318 is letter F, which is number three. 317 is a gray color, which is a, a pound sign, which you can't even see what I'm doing. It's a pound sign, so that's number two. Number one is 152, which we know is a kind of a pinkish color. It's a question mark. So yeah, so they go, the big number is where they at, are at on the canvas. If you're doubting yourself, look at the DMC code because it does have the DMC code on them. 
But let's just take a look at some of these colors in this. Because I know you guys like to see the colors. We got cream corn right there. We got sexy red. A lot of beautiful colors. Lots of blues and, and uh, browns. There's the first string. So a lot of beautiful colors in this kit. Oh, we got a straggler. We got a straggler. So there you have it. That is fan sales. They have their own website. I, of course, will link the web. I'm not going to link, link the canvases. Um, check out their inventory. I don't think it's massive, but I think they do have a good selection of inventory. They have a little bit of something for everyone. Do keep in mind that their canvases are not uh, the drilling area. It's the canvas itself, which we said we were going to measure the one, which I wanted to check this one because I didn't, on the drills, I didn't show whether or not they were the same way, which I think these are the same way as the, the boat. So I think number nine here is going to be 700. And it says 700 for the DMC code. So this one is just like the other one where it has the DMC code on the, the packaging. Let me, let me clean this up real quick and bring the other ones out. Hold on. All right, folks. So there you have it. We're going to measure this one real quick because I didn't measure it. And I want you guys to know. I'm pretty sure it's the same as the other ones. It's going to be the canvas and not the drills. So here we go. This one's at 24 by 34. So yeah, so this one is also the, the entire canvas, not the drilling area for the 30 by 40 or the 40 by 30. Um, clarity of symbols is there. Drill quality is there. DMC codes are there because I know that's important to a lot of people because they like to store their extra drills. These drills that come in these, these packages like this usually have really, really good drill quality. So if you were going to save drills, these are the type of drills that you would want to save. Don't worry, I'm not pulling them out. I'm just fixing that. So here are the three canvases that I, I got. I got the sailboat. I got our love is forever. And I got these adorable little hedgehogs on the spool of thread with the pencil. Oh my God, you guys, that's so cute. But with that said, folks, I would definitely give fan sales two big old thumbs up. If you see something like on the site, I would definitely recommend fan sales for snack size paintings. They are very budget, budget friendly as well. Um, so if you are interested in ordering from them and you weren't quite sure of the quality, just know the quality is there. For the price, you're getting what you're paying for. So dr nice drill qualities. They do include the DMC codes and everything else. But yes, I would highly recommend for snack size paintings, you go check out fan sales. But with that, folks, I, I, I also love, real quick before I go, I love the consistency of everything. I love the fact that everything has the DMC codes on it. The only one that didn't was the one that said love, but it had the canvas number and the number that it was because it was only six colors. So I don't even mind that it didn't have the DMC code colors on this because the DMC code is on the actual canvas itself like it is for the other three. So their product seems to be, for the most part, consistent. I do like that because a lot of these sites won't have consistency with their canvases. So with that said, folks, if you have any other questions, comments, or concerns about fan sales and would like to ask me, please leave that down in the comment section below. And I will try my best to answer it to the best that I can. I'm not, you know, this is the first time I've ever ordered from them. So any questions you might have about these canvases here, I can probably tell you a lot better than, you know, their entire inventory. But with that said, folks, if you're new to the channel and would like to see more random crazy videos just like this, please feel free to hit that subscribe button and the bell to be notified anytime I randomly decide to put up a video. And believe me, it's random. With that said, folks, I'm now going to have to bid you adieu. But not before reminding you, like I always try to, be kind, be courteous, be cool. Bye, guys.